What's up, everyone? Welcome to the Power Play with CJ24 Gassan on the Tampa Bay Lightning, moving on to the uh, Stanley Cup Final for the first time in 11 years. Just talk a little bit about the team and, uh, you know, my personal connection to the Tampa area. Um, and we'll start with that, actually. As many of you know, I spent four years in college in 2010 to 2014, living down in Tampa. I got to go to a lot of Lightning playoff games. I remember uh, in 2011, I was at a double overtime game. James Neal scored over time for Pittsburgh. It was amazing. It was just a great environment. And, uh, you know, that just showed that the Tampa fans are, are great hockey fans. Um, you know, they get a bad rap. You know, it's a warm weather city, and the, the baseball fans suck. Uh, go to a Rays game for me. It's, it's ridiculous. Um, but, you know, Stammer is, is a world class player, and being able to root on a guy like that on a consistent basis. I mean, you know. <laughs> Anyone, whether you're a hockey fan or not, can, can enjoy just how great he is at the game. And, uh, you know, again, I can't stand up good things with the people down there. Um, go figure. Again, the one year I'm out of Tampa, they, they're going to the final. But for what it's worth, my first year back in New England, the path won the Super Bowl. So it's a give and take, you know. And I take the Patriots Super Bowl over that any day of the week. But on to the, the X's and O's and, you know, dismissing my personal life. You look at, again, Stamkos, first overall pick. All right, easy to hit on him. Look at the next three guys in the the range in the Lightning scoring. Tyler Johnson, Nikita Kucherov, Andre Palat. Andre Palat was the 208th pick in the 2011 draft. He was passed over, I believe, in the 2009 and 2010 drafts. You look at Tyler Johnson, undrafted free agent. Every team in the league had at least one shot at, you know, had... Could have drafted him, you know, three different times. Could have signed him, whatnot. Kucherov fell in the draft because he was... You know, he's Russian, essentially. I mean, you know, look at his skill. Like, wow. He's Russian. I'll take him. Uh, you know, that's just, you know, how good of a team, how good Eisenman is at, you know, assembling talent. They were my preseason pick to go to the final for a reason. Um, you know, I, well, first of all, I had a four-year run of picking the Bruins in L.A. in the final. This this year ended it. I picked uh, L.A. And, and Tampa. So if Anaheim gets in, it's tech, L.A. metropolitan region, right? So I'm not wrong. Uh, the irony is, 2011, 2012, 2013, 2014, the Bruins or Kings were in the final, but just never against each other. So, and, to, and you know, to that point, uh, I'm at least 50 percent right. Uh, my playoff pick was uh, my at the beginning of the playoffs. I picked Anaheim and Tampa. So, depend upon the outcome of tomorrow, I, I could look really good, uh, but not to to pump my own. Tires to quote Greg Roberto Longo, but I love the way Eisenman has assembled this team. Again, you get the high draft picks. You get a kid like uh, Andre Schuster, sign him as undrafted free agent. Likewise with the aforementioned Tyler Johnson. You know, you look at you know guys like Brian Boyle and Anton Strom and even Brendan Morrow to a certain degree. Valtteri Filippola. They go, you know, they were all in Tampa for different reasons. Filippola was a little more of a you know bigger named free agent, but likewise. Those guys all have become good supporting cast members to the this Lightning squad, and again they all buy in, and um, you know they they play a really entertaining brand of hockey, and uh, you know it's it's really fun to watch, and they're getting a ton of results out of it, and uh, you know I consider all that talk about this Lightning team. I'm gonna give you a little spoiler. I got them one in the cup. Um, you know I got, I think they can beat Anaheim or Chicago. It's not it's my unofficial pick. But, uh, again, I, I like what I see from the squad, and, um, you know, fantastic Game 7 win. And uh, in New York, you know, really showed some character. So, you know, any chance you, the Bishop can beat the King, uh, I think you automatically win in chess. So, that's what you got. Anyway, that's all I have in this episode of the Power Play with CJ on the Tampa Bay Lightning moving on to the 2015 Stanley Cup Final. Stick to for the playoffs and beyond. Later, guys.